Congrats to the solar powered guys from Michigan. They just finished their cross country journey powered by the sun. They crossed the finish line in Los Angeles yesterday at 442 PM Pacific time, 742 hour time last night. The adventure lasted 13 days, 15 hours and 19 minutes and seven news Detroit producer Barry Cutler has been keeping in close contact with them. It takes a look at the end of their odyssey across the US. Check it out, the Cannonball Sun Car arriving yesterday in California, rolling through Hollywood toward its final destination, the Portofino Hotel in Los Angeles. All right! Woo! Yay! You made it! Gosh, we are so excited. We have been tracking these four engineering students, these road warriors from Michigan, for the past few weeks. They built the car from scratch and hit the road July 8th in New York City on what they call the Cannonball Sun Race. Driver Will Jones took the car on the final stretch. I hope so other people will kind of see this adventure, you know, they'll kind of believe in themselves, think, uh, think they can do whatever their challenge is, and uh, also, you know, solar Solar panels, solar power is a technology that's uh, going to do a lot of good in the future. A lot of mishaps along the way that, you know, we've, we've been able to keep the car on the road, but just barely, right? Um, and for me, this trip is kind of just about having fun. The guys soaked up the excitement with friends and family in Los Angeles, and they certainly have a lot to celebrate. Four modern-day explorers defying the norms of travel with their amazing achievement. Their day began Sunday with their Cannonball Sun car soaking up some final rays to get ready for the last leg of that journey. Earlier, they made it through the mountains. And when they hit Tinseltown, they turned on to Hollywood Way to make their final approach. Now, during this long journey, they had some breakdowns along the way and they brainstormed various ways to keep that car alive. One thing that I think um, all of us will take away from this trip um, is that even when uh, things are things are going rough and we, we really think there isn't another option, there's always another option, no matter what it is. If there's one thing that I want people to take away from this is that you should dream big and whatever that thing is that you want to do, go and do it. We want to give a huge shout out to everyone in the mitten. <laughs> Thank you for supporting us along the way. And go Huskies. Go Blue. Go Huskies. Go Dreams. The solar powered car guys using a little determination and sun power to play their small role in paving the way to what they hope will be a brighter and more sustainable future for travel. Barry Cutler, 7 News Detroit. How about that? And I love it that they were from different schools, you know, Michigan State, Michigan Tech, University of Michigan. They worked together to troubleshoot and solve those problems and reach their, their destination. I love that. You can find out more about the Solar Park guys and their truck across the country on CannonballSun.com. you got to check that out.